What makes the best head torch? Well, that depends on what you intend to use it for. For example, the needs of an angler will be different from that of a nighttime runner. So let's take a look at the options in store and you can decide which is the best one for you. Most head torches use LED technology because it's lightweight, non-breakable and requires a lot less power than the standard bulb. The brightness of the head torch is measured in lumens. Basically, the higher the number of lumens, the greater the light output. But brighter doesn't always mean better. In some scenarios, a low light output on a more focused beam is what you need, like when you're map reading or fishing. Let's take a look at the options available in store. This is a single LED head torch, which is really bright and gives out a good quality white light, which is super bright at night. Even though it's small, many of the single LED head torches have a magnifying lens in front of the LED, which allows it to provide good quality light for hours very efficiently. Many of the single LED head torches have an adjustable beam, so it allows you to tailor the intensity. Although single bulb head torches give good light penetration, they also give off a lot of heat, which means a lot of wasted energy. They're also less robust than LED bulbs, so it's a good idea to take a spare bulb and spare batteries for sustained periods of use. This is a multi-LED array head torch, which sometimes comes with different coloured LEDs, often red and green, which can be helpful if you don't want to lose your night vision or scare away wildlife at night. It will provide more light than a single LED head torch, but it may not have a greater beam distance. The head torch can be used in 3, 6 or 10 LED modes, depending on how much light you need and if you're trying to save energy. Be careful if you're using the red LED though, because in many places a red flashing light at night will be mistaken for a distress signal and they may call the mountain rescue. The last one I want to show you is a combined light array hybrid head torch. It has both a krypton and halogen bulb as well as different LEDs to satisfy different conditions. The standard bulb offers a long distance light and the LED offers a close source light as well as conserving power when you don't need the long distance light. It's ideal for running because it offers both beam distance and light flooding to illuminate the path ahead. So all that's left to think about is whether you need your head torch to be powered by batteries, rechargeable or wind up. Rechargeable is great if you have access to a power source. This could be mains power or a USB cable that attaches to your computer. If you're using a battery powered head torch, take spare batteries and remember that an LED head torch, the light will go out all at once, unlike traditional bulbs. Wind up is good, especially as an alternative, but it has a lower light output and a shorter runtime. So to recap, here are the top five things you need to consider when thinking about buying a head torch. Runtime. How long do you need to use the torch? Weight and size, as well as comfort and fit. Try the unit on before if you can. Beam focusing and angle adjustment. What features do you need? Waterproofness. Most head torches are showerproof. And finally, ease of use. Is it too fiddly? Can you operate it with gloves on? Armed with all this information, you're now ready to choose the best head torch for you. If you have any questions, just ask us in the comments below and we'll answer them. And please remember to like this video and subscribe to Mountain Warehouse. Thanks for watching.